Mercedes AMG Interview Lounge. That was awesome. Hi, how are that you? That was great. How are you? Thanks for not using the F word on the show. I appreciate that. <laughs> right before I went on, I was like, what's well, got like six F words in it? Like, I had to I ask someone, I was like, can I do them? But, I know, it's the weirdest yeah. thing. Yeah. It's, it's like, what year is this? And we still have to live in a world where we can't say the F word. I know, word. all the, the content and songs nowadays. I know, but the F word yeah. is like, it's the best word ever. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Uh, How's it going? Okay, but, you but, saw but, Anastasia. I did see Anastasia. Did you like it? I loved it. Thank you. And I thought you did a great job. And Thank I have so to much. say. How long ago did you see it? Uh, maybe three weeks ago, four weeks ago. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. Um, so I was a little warmed up by then. Yeah. All the people around me were like, is that Cody Simpson? Oh my God, it's Cody Simpson. Really? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The whole time I was like, it is, guys. And some people like, they don't look at the playbill, you know, before. And yeah. then like, they're like, I realized it was you like halfway through. I'm like, <laughs> halfway through? <laughs> wow. You guys are like, okay, I was wow. doing, a, you know, doing, doing all right. Yeah. That's not insulting yeah. at all. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So give him an honest opinion. Honestly, it was great. You did Thank a great you. job. Thank the set design much. was awesome. I had a cold that day, so if you remember, which I'm sure you don't, I was coughing through all the quiet parts. Yeah, okay. So when, uh, okay. when you're doing someone's, a show, someone's usually doing that. It's always one yeah. person. And if they're not that, coughing, that, yeah. if they're not coughing, they're opening candy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> like, people, oh yeah. People that go see live shows, they're just. I think the IQ level just sinks. I mean, yeah. they're just like, what are you doing? Yeah. This is a, a love scene. We're trying There'll to be quiet. this scene. You know, there's there's a couple scenes in there where you know. I, they're pretty emotional, like mm-hmm. like heavy emotional scenes, you know, and 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 you'll get to like a real quiet, silent moment, and you'll just hear someone going, like just no. you'll be like, Yuck. what do you do? Yeah. You yeah. Yeah. We were seeing yeah. Wicked, and the person behind us must have seen it a couple of times, and she was giving everything away. Every yeah, time yeah. something was about to happen, she was like, oh my gosh, wait till you see what happens oh, now. No, this I'll is ridiculous. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. yeah. So, so this is your Broadway debut. You've done stage work before. Um, man, this is my first my first show um, in really? musical theater. Yeah, and, um, and how polished you you seem like you've done it for years. It um it, it was it was something that kind of came really naturally to me. You know, I'd I'd uh, I'd auditioned and they you know were uh, the the rehearsals and everything were really good and you know just I kind of jumped in right away and and you know I was lucky to have a couple of really amazing. Um, co-stars in the show that you know really brought me up to to their level Look that have been you. doing it for years and years on end and everything and you know to slip right in and and um do it is is cool but cody really to cool do a broadway person. show is grueling yeah. i mean it's how many performances a week oh yeah you can't get away with anything i know, you know? I, yeah exactly yeah. No, there's no fun to be had no. but i mean is it something you want to do again or is it boom it's off the list? no absolutely um it's definitely an amazing box to be able to tick you know and, and right. it's something i've always thought about um or dreamed about but it wasn't like a rational i didn't think it was a rational dream you know and and um so now that it's happened i, I like i love to do more shows and um i absolutely love being on stage so so anastasia is yeah. on until the end of march right yeah march 31st is our closing day so i yeah. say uh scurry over to tkts or wherever you go to get tickets <laughs> yeah. go grab them yeah you won't be disappointed you won't be disappointed okay it's i want to i want to talk about we had i want to talk about uh definitely talk about cody simpson and the tide yeah all right i want to talk about the tattoo that's on his hand which is well, over here. An anchor. It's an yeah. anchor. And what's on your, is your right hand? As soon as I put it in water, it just sinks. No, um, I, I, I got a never, bunch. You've never used that joke before, have you? Um, that's <laughs> the first time. Are all, of your, are all of your tattoos? Same with the, that was the first time I sang the whole thing. Of course. Thing. Yeah, yeah. Is, uh, and all of your tattoos, are they nautical? Um, a fair few of them are. Um, I grew up, I grew up um, by the beach, you know, like surfing and sailing and doing all that kind of stuff. And so I, um, they've all just taken on a nautical. Do you have any shark bites? Feel. Shark bites? Do you no. Mean, never. Do you want one? No, <laughs> okay. absolutely not. All right, so all right, this is all going somewhere. So tomorrow, you are going to the UN, the United Nations, here mm-hmm. in New York City, and you are going to speak. Yeah, which, I've, which um, to me, I mean, of all the performances you've done, I would think this would make you a little nervous. Yeah, I've I've actually been there a few times. I've spoken um, once or twice before. Um, they have, I mean, tomorrow's World Wildlife Day, but they have uh, World Oceans Days every, uh, annually. And um, I've uh, spoken there once before and made uh, a doc, a small documentary that we showed there once on uh, elimination of um, single-use plastics and things like that. So, right. Um, oh, so it's because of you we don't use straws anymore. Yay. Good. Uh, I'd hope, yeah. I, I hope <laughs> so. Right. You know, I've I've, I've encouraged uh, a bunch of my fans and things to to really make personal changes and, and stuff, are. and that that means like a lot to me but when I are. see we're like make, messages like, hey, you know, I I said no to a plastic bag at the grocery store today because of you and all this stuff, and that Aww. you know that that almost means more to me than like, yeah, I love I love your song. It means so much to me. All this all that stuff. So so growing yeah. up around the ocean, I yeah. mean, it, it, it's your it was your backyard for so many years yeah and look in yeah. the ocean if you think about it to each and every one of us even if you're landlocked in the middle of new mexico or if you're living in south florida or all of us in the north everywhere you go the ocean is such an important part of your life and mm-hmm. and even 
I don't think we think about that enough, and that's what you're helping to do. Bring it to the yeah, top of thought. That's the that's the thing, you know. If you if you if you're a even if you're a kid my age growing up in the middle of New York City, you know, um, environmental awareness isn't necessarily on your daily you know thoughts or on your daily in your daily consciousness because you're not like you know around you know nature and all this stuff that you know makes you be like oh okay well this would actually be quite devastating if you know this didn't exist anymore or right. that you know and and that's that's what i learned having grown up around it is that is how wonderful it is and how how much good it does for people and yeah I get it. Yeah. So, yeah. so look, you know, what we do for a living, we come in here every day and have a great time. What yeah. else are we doing in addition to this to help save the planet, right. save wildlife? I mean, yeah. think about it. I mean, you know, and that's why we encourage people to help teachers and help law enforcement agents and help people in the military. These are all important people, but also the people who are protecting wildlife and our ocean, just as important. Congratulations yeah, on that. Thank now, you, man. Thank so, all right. So. Uh, Cody Simpson and the Tide. See more nautical stuff. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> who's the Tide? I mean, it's your band, right? Yeah, I got uh, it's me and uh, bass player and drummer, two two buddies of mine. Right. Yeah, and um, you know, we all they all um, we all produce the music together and all that kind of stuff. So, so yeah. you you have yeah. two EPs out. One that just came out uh, several months ago. Yeah. Um, we got we got wave one and wave two, um, <laughs> <laughs> um, and um, are, you, are you seeing a, a connection? Uh, I am. And then we have all these B sides, which are all the um, kind of more uh, guitar tunes that I've written that I that I had that I've had like locked away for a while that I wanted to put out and have you know let let see the light of day and stuff. So um, that you know we had tune that I played before was uh, on the B sides playlist. Right, we had. Yeah. Yeah. I will tell you this: yeah. if you listen to uh, the music, you can yeah. you can actually hear a beachy thing. <laughs> you can yeah. you can hear sort of like a, a a surfing. There's like common, yeah. There's like definitely common threads, you know, throughout just sonically, like that weave throughout all the music. Um, so that's so cool. Yeah, yeah man. So look, you yeah. know, I think we met Cody years ago, and between then and now, here you are starring in a Broadway musical, a heavy broad Broadway musical. Yeah. You're going to the UN to speak on behalf of wildlife and the in the ocean. Mm -hmm. wow. Look at where you are now and what you're doing. Pretty Thanks, cool man. life. Thank you. Yeah, I, I, living a dream, man. I swear. You know, I get to I get to do all the things that that I dreamed of when I was a little boy. So, yeah. You're like the, awesome. the Bono of the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, he's he's one of my he's one of the gods to me. He really so is. yeah, yeah, he does it all, and you know, he's he's someone that. Him, Sting, these guys are all all guys that I look to, and I'm like, if I could model a life after these kind of guys like that, you know, well, they, die, they die both, a happy they, man. Yeah. So. They both sat in that chair. So. Did they? Bono gave me a massage. Yeah. Remember that? that was kind of weird. Right. That was a weird day. <laughs> uh, anyway, well, so Cody Simpson, uh, until the end of March, uh, in Anastasia. Mm -hmm. Not anesthesia, like no, I said earlier. No. That that is, everyone's asleep in that one. Anesthesia, yeah. yeah. Exactly. Yeah. And, and also, uh, check out his music. Do a search for Cody Simpson or Cody Simpson and the Tide. Thank you so much for coming Spotify, in Spotify, iTunes, the whole deal. iHeartRadio. iHeartRadio. <laughs> Stop it. Exactly. All right, thank you, Cody. So iHeartRadio. Yeah, thank you. Let's get that straight. Elvis Duran. Thank you. Yeah. Cody Simpson. And the morning show. We'll take a break. We're right back after this.